It's rocking them, it's sunny, it's probably going to rain tomorrow. You've had free practice out of the way. Ollie Pidgeley, how are you, mate? Do you want to give Mark Marquez his hat back? <laughs> Funny. Uh, no, yeah, we've done two FPs. You're so, so mature. Um, no, we, yeah, we've done two FPs. They were fine. Just what you expect, really. First time in the car. We haven't even done a test day. Obviously, we've done the shakedown and everything and did the um, mileage that we needed to do before entering. But other than that, we've done no testing or anything. So we really have been chucked in at the deep end. Um, but it's, it's good. We've done exactly what we expected to. If anything, we're actually a little bit better than we thought, mm -hmm. um, which, is, which is obviously a bonus. So. Tell us about the mileage you're on about. You've got to do 300 k's before you drive a touring car. That's yeah. my understanding. Yeah, so it's 300 kilometres. Um, I actually, at the end of 2016, I did a little bit in the Sicily car because I was with them in Cleo's. I think that counted towards 40 or 50 of those kilometres. So we did another 250 or 260 at uh, Bruntingthorpe on Wednesday, I think it was, or Thursday. Um, so that was all good. So yeah, we did the excess mileage and it was just to get more comfortable in the car. I'm glad I did that having come here now. Um, I'm glad that rule was in place because it you know, gave me another half a day in the car, really. The car's a good car around here, isn't it? It's won, I think, uh, year, a few years ago with Aaron Taylor-Smith. Um, what are you expecting, mate? You, you know, Bushel's gone quite well. What's the data saying? Yeah, like you said, Bushel's gone well. Bush, we knew Bushel was going to be fast anyway. He has been since I was teammates with him in Clio's. Um, as long as I can, for, the, for this race and the rest of the season, if I can finish every race and just kind of stay, stay within the pack. We're a moment we're getting faster each session, but... You just don't really know what to expect, really, because I haven't never done anything like this. I don't really know what to expect. If we can finish every lap and be competitive, that's all. I'd be happy with that at the end of the year, really. Top man. OK, we'll leave you to it. Ollie Pitchley, tomorrow, 10.45, ITV4. It's going to be awesome. I reckon he might win the Hat of the Year award. <laughs> yeah, brilliant. <laughs>